Now, Kenyans have been urged to be conscious of data confidentiality before exposing too much of their personal information in the digital space. Well, the Office of the Data Protection Commissioner says that uh, if possible, uh, Kenyans should demand to sign a consent to guard information that can be made public uh, to hold digital players to account for any breaches. So that even then, they have an obligation to protect the data. Number one, by not collecting what is not necessary. During the second day of the county awareness outreach session in Tana River, the residents were enlightened on the rights they hold before giving information to digital sector players. Understand what, uh, first of all, who is this data controller? What uh, type of data does he or she want? How is he going to process this data? And you also need to understand uh, maybe the consequences and uh, the effects of how this your data is going to be used. Because without understanding that, you may find yourself uh, giving out too much data that you ought not to have given out. Locals who attended the meeting questioned what is being done to nip the increased case of online fraudsters swindling gullible Kenyans. I'm a stranger. I didn't pick it up and I can't remember how I can do it. 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 I the commission promising to ensure that those negligent with protection of data entrusted to them are held accountable. Minimization ni uh, just minimal. Pick data that you only required to, to pick. Even as the commission in conjunction with other stakeholders works towards finding a lasting solution to online fraudsters, Kenyans have been urged to carefully read and understand all the guidelines before accepting to anything, especially during online transactions. Reporting for Easy Friday from Hola, Tanariva County, I'm Zainab Said.